Uh, I do want to make one quick little announcement to any of you who thought that this is going to be a session where you could come and sit and drink your coffee and get warmed up for the day a little bit and text your friends. Uh, we're going to work today. So I want to heed the warning. Uh, this is going to be a little bit of a work session. I'm going to give you plenty of opportunities to get engaged with each other, to get engaged with the ideas that I present today, to engage with a protocol that I have found to be very useful. Uh, and it's pretty exciting for me. So uh, before we get really started, though, I think it's important that we kind of get to know each other a little bit because we're going to spend an hour and a half together. And even in a virtual session or in a session like this, you need to know who you're dealing with. So I'm going to introduce myself. I told you a little bit. My name is Pete Hall. I'm currently the principal of Shaw Middle School in Spokane, Washington. Uh, but in order for you to really know who I am, I share a little segment that I call Only in Idaho. Because though I work in Spokane, Washington, I live right across the state line in, in Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. Anybody been to Coeur d'Alene, Idaho before? All right, a couple of brave souls. You know how beautiful it is. You know how wonderful it is outside. Uh, we'll answer this question. Who is this guy? Well, here's Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. They, uh, we've got the Coeur d'Alene Golf Resort that has the world's only floating green on the golf course. As if golf wasn't hard enough. Uh, they, they put it out there in the middle of nowhere. Actually, it's retractable, too. It weighs 500 tons, but they've got it tethered to these giant cables, and they can change the distance, how far away from the shore it is, depending on uh, how mean they want to be on that particular day. Uh, but we've also got some beautiful wildlife. It's a great outdoors place. We've got, this is a photograph that your amateur photographer presenter took himself. There's a bald eagle right there at the lake. Uh, some, some fantastic animals. We also use our animals. We use them very wisely, as often as possible. Uh, and if, just in case you're thinking that being in Philadelphia, the traffic is crazy. And I know that was one of the thoughts that I had when I first got here, coming over from the airport. It should have only taken a couple minutes, but it took about an hour. And I, I thought, geez, the traffic is crazy. But then I was reflecting back to, to Coeur d'Alene, and I thought, well, you know, it's not that bad. We've got traffic jams, too. You know, <laughs> it happens. Don't worry about it. Actually, uh, I, uh, I had my first Philly cheesesteak sandwich last night. Anybody else had one since you've been here? Don't, don't you have to when you come to Philadelphia? You have to have one of those? You know, and I've been to places like Paris and New York, and I've had some fine dining. I've had exquisite meals, but never like in Coeur d'Alene at the, at the chicken basket. <laughs> and actually, if you look real closely, there is somebody standing in front of the chicken basket there. Let's find out what he's got going on there. Oh, it's Gizzard Day. Yeah, you don't want to miss Gizzard Day if you have the opportunity. You want to make sure that you stop by and then go uh, skateboarding at the skate park right across the street. Uh, some beautiful, beautiful things. 